by the way, people, I'm eminently qualified to be making this assessment. I was four years early. My moment was supposed to be four years ago. I played a role in the demise of the Israeli state. It's why I haven't seen my parents for more than two years. Everybody knows I was targeted at Gettysburg College. It's not a secret, right? Just like we were targeted at the Graduate Center when we were working on the BDS resolution. Israel has been a pariah state just like the United States has. That's why I've been so angry. Because this world ain't shit, people. The Democrats literally have their panties in a bunch. We're all out here in Hollywood laughing all the way to the bank. Look what Dave Chappelle did. That's called reparations, my friends. Reparations. And this is the world paying its reparations to the mainstream interpreters of the Abrahamic religions who don't know their ass from their face. And would that they did know their ass from their face? Because I know my ass really well. It's actually an important part of your anatomy, right? This is why they made me in Hollywood, people. I did not want to fucking do this. A year ago on Easter, Easter came early this year. I had a hole in my scrotum at LA County Hospital, the original building of which served as the front of General Hospital, the long-running soap opera, or, depending on your idioma, telenovela, si, si, conio, conio, me encanta, conio, si, 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 mis amigas, y mis amigos, En mi vida, yo aprendí que es como se dice, muy, muy importante para entender otras idiomas. Oh, 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 idiomas. Otras, sí. Sí, es, 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 es muy importante. Sí. ¿Por qué uh, el más idiomas? Más o menos el blumbito. Sí, el blumbito. El blumbito with the white... Paint. Remember how Bloomberg, when he tried to steal the presidency by whitewashing his record, right? Yo, people, if you snooze, you lose. And people been sleeping out there. <laughs> the entire world's changed. And everyone's laughing at the failure of the American empire, which can be seen so clearly in what's happening in its karmic twin, the Israeli state, right? Thank God these countries are coming to an end. They have done nothing good for the world except destroy it, just like Gaza's been destroyed. Right? And who financed it? Not me. I haven't paid taxes 
in years. Just like I haven't taken any money from the federal government in years. I didn't fucking take Trump's stimulus payments. So all you all who did, you actually do have blood on your hands, motherfuckers. I didn't want fucking Steve Munchkin, Munchkin, whatever the fuck that... What the actual fuck, people? This is my act at the improv. I'm making my coming out, if you will, on April 9th, the birthday of my dear friend and stylist, Stacy Tabarez. Say her name. Right? Yeah, I might be a little bit jowly, but it's hard for me to sleep, my friends. That's why I just take care of business. It's called meditation. And then today, right, I see that meditation is now bad for you. This is what I'm seeing in the news, people. Now, meditation is bad for you. Oh, really? Just turn off the channel, people. Madonna's right. I didn't know this about her. She doesn't watch television either. It's stupid. I haven't watched television since the pandemic happened, right? I haven't watched television since Game of Thrones. What's the point? Go paint. You know what I mean? I talked to my brother and sister-in-law yesterday. They're painting. You know, that's what they're doing in their spare time. I was like, you know what? That's great. Right? That's what we all should be doing, right? Contributing to beauty, on this planet, right? Instead of contributing to its destruction, right? It's just, it's garbage, people. And I'm putting all this up online. It's my new project, the Armenian Quarter. I was saved in Glendale. Between Pasadena and Hollywood, I was able to heal from the garbage that was thrown my way during the pandemic. And I said, just keep it coming, my friends. I'll be your sacred cow. I'll be your sacrificial lamb. Whatever fucking metaphor you want to use, I'll be it. Okay, because I just don't give a shit. You know what I mean? I just separated from the love of my life. I just lost a job that I loved, and which I was good at, objectively, right? Precisely because I let go of every single fucking piece of instruction 99.9% of white people ever said to me. And Armenians are not white, internationally speaking, right? Because guess what? Azerbaijan... is fucking with Armenia right now, right? There's more going on in the world, right? I mean, put it together, people. Russia, Ukraine, Armenia, Azerbaijan, China, Taiwan, the United... Who do I sound like? Trump. United States, Mexico, right? God forbid. God forbid the so-called land of immigrants should no longer allow immigrants here. Again, I say, if these were your kids right, on the playground, you'd say they weren't raised right. Well, that's what I'm saying, yo. These people have not been raised right. Okay? You just have not been raised right. Right? Thank God I moved to Hollywood. Thank God I moved to Southern California. Thank God I live with people who speak Japanese. Right? Which is a whole different script. A whole different fucking history, people. God damn it. Right? And this is called acting. Right? I have no choice but to do this. Right? Because I was doing this in my classroom, only this is an elevated version of what I was doing. Right? My students made me, every single one of them. Have you ever tried to keep the attention of a group of 18 to 22 year olds? That's why when the pandemic happened, I was like, fuck this shit. I'm not going to make you come to class. Right? They were freaking out. Because for one thing, they were being lied to left and right. Right? And I was like, no, 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 no. The buck stops with me. That's an American tradition that I understand. 
right? The buck stops with me. And I said, no, you're being lied to by the college administration. You're being lied to by your government. You're being lied to by friends because they're just following the lead of the bad actors, right? I mean, that's one of the things I learned, people, in my four-year wait to be able to move on with my life. because of the fucking pandemic, I'm just back to where I was four years ago in terms of being able to move forward in the world. I had to slow the fuck down. And in that time period, as I was saying, I learned a lot of fucking things. And one of them is that putting your kids in school with a lot of other kids, such as we do in this country, in America, and in a lot of countries, is actually terrible. Precisely for the reasons we all know, because kids are bullied in school, right? Kids are teased in school. Kids pass on the worst habits in school. 